go to the tools panel and select the donut tool. Select that, drag and hold down the shift so you get a circular donut design. You can see it here. Go to the layers panel and you can click effects. Just click there, go to outer shadow, click and then change the radius and offset and intensity. Put them to the max. 3D, click there and set it to about 20 and close. So you've got a lovely style design for your donut. Go to the move tool, hold down the ultra option key on your keyboard and drag. So now with that, you've got three shapes. They're all identical. So these designs, of course, you could set them to any color. It doesn't matter. I can now align them. So I'm just going to click here, align and align. So nicely aligned all on top of each other. You can also select them individually. So select that one and change the color. I'm just going to make it yellow. Click here and I'm going to make that one red. You can make them any color. And you can see them here. Select the top one and then go to the donut tool. With the donut tool, you've got interactive tools. You can modify this one here. See this one? You can just drag that out and then you can see the red one. That's the second layer. Select the second layer and then you can drag this one out. Just drag it out a bit less than last time. And you can see now you've got green, you've got red and you've got the yellow. You've also got another interactive tool. So go to this donut and you can see this little red dot here. And that is for that one. So if I change that now, you can see more of the red and less of the yellow. So I can just drag that all the way around. I can put it there or there or there or there. So you can create infinite combinations using this. Go to this donut and do exact same. You can see this little red dot and that's for the red. The one that's selected, that's the interactive control. And you can modify that so you can move that around. Go to this donut and you can do exactly the same with that little interactive control. You don't have to. But you can move it around, reposition it, maybe there. You can always change your mind and put it like that. You don't have to keep them aligned. You can always, of course, just go there and select that one and move it. If you want to move it, you can do that. You can also select them all, with them all selected like that. You can go to layer and you can merge them visible into a single design, a single pixel layer. So merge visible, they've all become a pixel layer. You can now apply effects to them. Filters, blur and Gaussian blur or any other effect. Click apply. You can also use them as a brush stroke now or pattern design. So go to layer and new pattern layer from selection. And you can see what happens. You get a lovely pattern design using your donut design. 